Sean Diddy Combs, a major figure in the booth music industry and Hollywood social circles, has recently faced serious charges of sex trafficking, racketeering, and coercion involving both women and male sex workers. His indictment claims that he orchestrated a decades long scheme involving abusive acts, blackmail, and financial manipulation to keep his victims silent. The accusations are particularly shocking given Didi's long standing influence in entertainment. Over his career, he has been closely associated with many major figures in music and film, such as Jay Z, Beyonce, Kanye West, Jennifer Lopez, and has maintained friendships with influential Hollywood stars, including Leonardo DiCaprio and Kim Kardashian. Known for throwing lavish parties in Los Angeles and the Hamptons, Didi has been a constant presence at high-profile events like the Met Gala and the Oscars, where he mingled with elite celebrities. This influence has extended beyond personal relationships as he used his wealth and connections to allegedly maintain control over his victims. The indictment suggests that he leveraged his influence in Hollywood, offering career opportunities and financial rewards in exchange for silence from victims. One of the cases cited in the investigations involved his former girlfriend, Kazi, who settled a civil lawsuit after accusing him of sexual abuse and violence. This along with others, helped spark the federal investigation that led to Didi's arrest. These revelations have sent shockwaves through both the music industry and Hollywood, as Didi was often seen as a reformed figure, having survived the notorious East Coast, West Coast rap wars in the 1990s. Didi recent legal troubles have not only brought forward shocking allegations of sexual abuse and trafficking, but they have also reignited discussions surrounding past controversies including his alleged connections to the unsolved murder of rapper Tupac Shakur. Didi's name has been frequently mentioned in conspiracy theories involving Tupac murder due to his involvement in the infamous East Coast West Coast rap feud of the 1990s. The East Coast West Coast rivalry reached its peak in the mid 1990s, with Didi representing the East Coast alongside his label Bad Boy Entertainment and to pack aligning with the West Coast through Death Row Records, led by Serge Knight. Tensions escalated in the aftermath of a robbery and shooting of Tupac in 1994, after which Tupac openly accused Didi and his protege, notorious B.I.G., of being involved in the attack, fueling animosity between the camps. Tupac was shot and killed in a drive-by shooting in Las Vegas in 1996, just months before the murder of Notorious B.I.G. in 1997. While neither murder has been officially solved, Didi has faced suspicions due to his proximity to the events and his role in the escalating rivalry. Several theories suggest that Didi might have been involved in orchestrating Tupac's murder as part of the feud, although no conclusive evidence has been provided. In 2018, former LAPD detective Greg Cudding claimed in a Netflix documentary that Didi had offered $1 million to have Tupac and Serge Knight killed though these allegations were never proven in court. These unresolved rumors have complicated Didi's public image, especially as the recent sex trafficking and abuse allegations surface. His alleged involvement in criminal activity over decades combined with earlier accusations linked to Tupac's case paint a picture of a figure deeply entrenched in controversial and violent incidents with both the music industry and personal spheres. Now, what do you think about Diddy? Will he survive this round? 
drop your opinion on the comment section.